What's going on today, guys? Uh, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're going to be doing another breakdown on the 2016 F-150. Uh, but most of the Ford line, if not uh, all the other lines uh, of trucks, are going to be about the same, uh, whether you have uh, an older model or a newer model. Uh, so let's get in, down to it. Uh, the first thing, get you something plastic. Uh, if you have to use uh, like a screwdriver or something, get you like a piece of paper or a towel or something or like a, a shop to pry it off so you don't scratch nothing but get yourself one of these i've already got it popped off um, they're pretty easy to pop off anyway you've got two clips here and you got two clips up here you have one wiring harness here with a little clip right there you just push in pops right out you are going to have a 10 millimeter. You're going to need a 10 millimeter. Uh, you don't really need an extension. Um, I've got quarter inch. Um, you've got two nuts here, and then you have two bolts here uh, that I missed the first time. So you're going to take this one off. I already had it off, so they weren't that loose. Make sure they don't fall inside there. And there's your two nuts here. For the bolts we got here, probably about an inch long. And then you're going to want to take the clip. There's a little clip there. Just pull that out. And let's go to the other side. When taking this off, it's going to be pretty self-explanatory. All of the bolts off. There is just one uh, clip up here. As you can see, the bottom comes off pretty easy. There's one little clip on there that you can kind of just work itself out, and it pulls right out. And uh, if you need anything else, there is this plastic piece here. That pops off in case you need like the wiring to know the wires or anything uh, under there. Uh, but that's basically it. And you're just going to do it in reverse. I won't show all that, but uh, make sure you get this on. And when it pops back into place, you'll want to get that one clip in. And that's it. And then it holds itself there. And then you'll come back around and... You'll plug everything back in. Make sure the one step you don't forget, make sure you put this clip in there first. Um, I would probably put the nut up here before you uh, push that on just in case the whole thing pops off. Uh, but other than that, that's about it for that. If you're gonna be uh, replacing the, t the regular mirror with a tow mirror, or if the mirror itself breaks or anything like that, uh, it's just a good video, real quick, simple, on how to take those off and put them back on. All right, till next time, guys.